version 5, or Lollipop, the Material Design Library was introduced. It includes many new design features and components that make Android apps much more attractive to users. New and old Android developers need to learn the faster way to create projects using Material Design. By using certain libraries, you can boost your development schedule and add awesome features in very reasonable time. Here are some of the best Android Material Design libraries that you should include in all of your projects. First and most important is Android Design Support Library, which is the support library from Google, which adds material design components to all developers and to all Android 2.1 or higher devices. This is just a typical material design library from Google, which contains navigation view, floating text view, floating button, snack bar, tab layout, and other components. The second library that you should check is Circular Reveal. This library has a very useful and stylish effect for showing new information on your screen without being too intrusive. It is really easy to implement and to add on your project. A usual effect found in material design is the ripple effect. The library with the same name developed by Triax allows you to give this effect to practically any clickable component in your view. Plus, it is extremely easy to incorporate in your project. The fourth library that you shouldn't miss is Floating Action Button, developed by Clans. This library is based on another Floating Action Button library, developed by Future Simple. With this library, you'll be able to use the floating action button at its best. As you can see, one of the best features of this library is the floating action menu. The last library we'll see in this video is Material Design Library developed by Navas MDC. It is an awesome library to implement for quickly adding 100% functional components in your app. It has basically everything you need in order to develop an app with Material Design meaning buttons, switches, progress indicators, snack bar, and other components. That's all for now. Thanks for watching. If you have any further questions, just leave a comment below. Otherwise, until next time.